Uh, every play we ran, passing play, running play, even on defense, they call that play beast mode, they'd yell it. When they got an A on a paper, they'd yell it. I don't really have a question, but I was hoping maybe you could give Winans Academy a Hey, shout look. Out. I mean, all week, I done told y'all what's up. And for some reason, y'all continue to come back and do the same thing that y'all did. I don't know what story y'all trying to get out of me. I don't know what image y'all trying to portray of me. But it don't matter what y'all think, what y'all say about me. Because when I go home at night, the same people that I look in the face, my family, that I love, <laughs> that's all I really, that matter to me. So y'all could go and make up whatever y'all want to make up. Because I don't say enough for y'all to go and put anything out on me. But I'll come to y'all event, y'all shove cameras and microphones down my throat. But when I'm at home in my environment, I don't see y'all. <laughs> but y'all mad at me. And if y'all ain't mad at me, then what y'all here for? Actually, I'm not mad at I ain't got nothing for y'all, though. I told y'all that, so y'all should know that. But y'all will sit here, like, right now and continue to do the same thing. I'm here preparing for a game, and y'all want to ask me all these questions, which is understandable. I could get down with that. But I told y'all, I'm not about to say nothing. So for the remainder of my, what's that, three minutes, because I'm here, I'm available for y'all. I'm here, I'm available for y'all. I done talked. All of my requirements are fulfilled. So now for this next three minutes, I'll just be looking at y'all the way that y'all looking at me. Thank you. 1992 at Super Bowl 27. I had an opportunity to talk to Tupac Shakur. This is real talk. When I played for the Jets, and I grew up on the south side of Chicago, and I understand, we had a conversation about the inner city and the problems there in the inner city. Is there anything you could tell us about your charity, anything that you would like when to When I'm to in them city? inner cities? Yeah, when you have When home. I'm in them inner cities? Yeah. Come to them inner cities and come and holler at me then. Okay, I'll do that. Thank I'm you. I'm going to hold you to that. I'm going to hold you to that. All right, African. Thank you so much. Yep. Marshawn, any statement you have about the league possibly <laughs> buying you for your old beast mode gear that you like to wear? That's a statement for the league? Y'all got two more minutes to look at me. Yesterday, Chris Carter made the uh, <laughs> statement. He said he feels like you have the best possibility to make the Hall of Fame out of all active running backs. I just wanted to know if you had any thought on that, if you feel like your exchange with the media would have any impact on that. Understood. Understood. Anybody else? Shout out Oakland, California. How you feeling today? Shout out Westbrook. How's your mom doing? Shout out my teammates. Marshawn, can I get a shout out to Wyman's Academy? Those are kids in the office. Marshawn, can I get that hat on line? What's up, African? Shout out to my real Africans out there. <laughs> Y'all got another minute to look at me, though. Hola. <laughs> Are you excited about the Super Bowl and something? Make a conversation, Marshall. <laughs> the media. Y'all minute is running out. Where can we buy beef mode gear? Beastmodeonline.com. <laughs> Shout out to my teammates. Shout out family first. All of them. I got 20 seconds. Last 20 seconds for the outcome of the game? Then I'm finna sit here with my mouth closed and look at you.
Thank you. And so this strange drama continues to play out now for a third straight day. Uh, Marshawn Lynch fulfilling his media obligations, will not be fined for doing so, might be fined for again wearing the Beast Mode hat, and he gave a plug on where we can buy those now, sold out. Uh, <laughs> Always helpful. But you know what? He, he made it very...